Well, that reminds me, so I think I met you almost two years ago now, mm -hmm. right? We kind of sat down for the first time and, um, and you laid out this analogy um, that, you know, we've kind of refined into this concept of the octopus rules, mm -hmm. right? And you talked about how this is really your, your passion, not only with Biscochito, but in a larger perspective of, of all the work that you do. So could you share a little bit with the folks that haven't heard about this, this analogy and maybe give us, the, give us the Kimberly spiel on the octopus? I'll try. Okay. <laughs> um, so just like when you asked me, like, if you're doing business differently, and I said, like, nobody cares, because they don't. Um, we have this way of processing information that comes to us. And it's the way that we've been taught to think and process and understand. And it happens in business and in our personal lives. And we sense through what we hear and what we see, and then we process it. But we're sensing so much more than that. And we have, you know, it's almost like in a business hierarchy, you know, you have your org chart, which is just this pyramid and the CEO at the top, and you have a lot of middle management and then people who do the work. And um, we think we are that way, too. We think that the CEO lives up here, and then we have some middle management that happens that gets the blood flowing, and then, like, we do some work out here. Neither of those things are necessarily true. We take in and process information throughout our entire bodies. And if we can think about a business organization as an organism more like an octopus, as opposed to, you know, we have this top-down thinking for people and a top-down thinking for organizations and businesses. If we think about an octopus, in an octopus, their neurons, the synapses, the things that actually, the thinking things, are distributed throughout an octopus's body. They're thinking and responding over here. You know, they're changing color, they're grabbing something, they're changing the shape to blend in with their environment. Well before, and over here can be doing something else entirely based upon where they are. It's a different way of processing information. And we also have many ways to process information within our bodies and within our organizations. It doesn't have to do this. We can stretch out and do this in other ways. And it's very cool when we do. Like, it's really fun. Um, and we know more, and we sense more, and we feel more. And it's just a very different ride. 